anger is a fascinating thing, right? Because we mostly think about anger in a negative context. Anger hijacks your nervous system, it hijacks your cardiovascular system, it secretes all kinds of chemicals, adrenaline, getting you ready for fight or flight in many instances. It releases cortisol and stress. I mean, anger, it can be negative. However, there are times when anger is what's needed to push you towards a kind of threshold to actually act and make a change and then something that needs to be addressed, maybe something that's just been bubbling in your life or in your, or in your job or in whatever or a relationship that you weren't happy with. And maybe what it takes is this chemical cocktail of anger to finally push you through the threshold to create finally a change in behavior that leads to a butterfly effect and new possibilities opening up. So in those contexts, I think anger can actually be a positive thing. It all depends. What is the net result? What do you get from the anger? There is gonna be that cardiovascular cost, that nervous system cost, because it's being hijacked, cortisol, stress maybe, but does it lead to catharsis? Does it lead to some kind of resolution? Does it lead to positive action? And it can be 